Hello guys, welcome back. I must admit it's been a little while since I've turned this on, but uh, I'm back now. Last I left off, we made our way up Mount Rikuoa, which hopefully we'll finally leave. I'm so sick of uh, trying to remember how to pronounce this place. We've got uh, Caravan over there with Noah over there, and we go give her a hand. Meta, it's Meta. Meta is here. Meta, I'm glad you found yourself a nice child to- Oh my god, that sounds so bad. Vaughn. Vaughn is his name? Vaughn, please, help this child. Help Noah. Vaughn, let's go. Alright. Uh, let's double check our inventory first. Let's get this party started. Noah, let me help you. <laughs> Gotta love that music. Alright, do our do our required spirit first. I actually don't remember how many attacks each character has. Okay, he's got... Seven. Now in these cases, we don't really want to hold back. Try and pump out as many combos as we can. We can use... It's like five. So that's probably going to be his best combo right now. Take a look at hers. She can use six. She's only got one page though, so five attacks. And it looks like Acrobatic Blitz comboing into Bird Step is her best combo right now. Oh, I can get another attack in too. he's going to block every single hit. Was I able to get Vera? I was. remember if that spell will take priority. Well, we'll give it a shot and see what happens. That's what I was afraid of. Well, at least he's attacking Vaughn first. Vera is a very good healing spell. Look at that. It's pretty cheap too, it only costs 6 MP. No, I'm on spirit. I command. Try this again. Very nice. Oh man. I think 
this time we'll have Noah just use her own healing spell. Or not a spell, uh, item. There we go. Man, screw off. forgotten how tough this boss is. The bosses in this game aren't really a joke. They can hit hard. Especially once you get later in the game. Uh, there's this one boss called uh, Berserker. I hear Berserker is one of those bosses that makes people quit the game just because of how difficult he is. We're not going to let that happen to me, though. Yeah. Alright, thankfully she's spirited. Good, okay. Unfortunately, it's kind of a rinse and repeat because they don't have enough uh, spirit bar to fit a lot of combos in. So you kind of just have to stick with the most powerful combo you have. And this is not the right time to be playing around with different attacks. That's what random battles are for. Oh, this is gonna hurt. to use Vera again, but items take priority. Once I'm done here, I can always buy more healing leaves. They're not expensive. Part of the reason why Noah is getting hit so hard is because she doesn't have any armor. So that's going to be one of the first things I'll have to do uh, once I have the chance. For now, though, we got to keep cracking away at this guy. It's probably best to just try and get as many attacks in as I can. Go with Mirage Lancer. Hey, we knocked him down. Means he's about halfway down. Here we go. Also probably not a good idea to attack a fire monster with a fire attack. But it's the best I have. him heal this time and get a spirit in on her side. Yeah, go ahead, attack on. He's fine. He can take it. Oh, 
Okay, um, we'll give him a heal. We'll throw out an attack on her side. There we go. Hey, hey, we got it. Level ups. Ooh, a healing bloom. A healing bloom will heal the whole party, which is very nice to have. Anybody who's played Final Fantasy knows those are pretty hard to find. Like a mega elixir, or a mega potion. Noah, you have done well. Now please, take me to the Genesis tree. Fawn, let's help them. Alright Vaughn, let's give our strength to the Genesis tree. Oh hell, fuck. First I gotta save. Vaughn, I, I wanna save! Ugh. Fine. Vaughn gently touched the trunk of the Genesis tree. Vaughn feels a gentle warmth in the palm of his hand. Awaken, Genesis tree. Recall the instant that the heavens and earth were born. Just as happened before, clearing the whole area of the mist. I love this part. <laughs> the first thing he does when he's cured. Oh, gotta fix the mustache. This power is just what I needed. Alright, Noah, let's go. Noah, listen well. You and I are now one. You now possess magnificent powers. You and Vaughn must go on a journey to search out the Genesis trees. The journey may be difficult, but remember that I will always be with you. With the power of the Genesis tree, Meta's level increased to level two. Bye-bye, little wolf. No, Noah, you mustn't follow her. The wolf is a proud animal. She's going to find a place where she can die alone. Sovan. Vaughn, will you take me with you? No. No, I don't think so. Vaughn, you must be nice to her. I was only fooling anyway. Yeah, come on, let's go. Good, so I won't be alone. I'll be with you, Vaughn. Fanfare! Vaughn, let's return to Drake Castle. I'm sure the people freed from the mist are waiting for you. Now how the hell could you possibly know that? And say goodbye to a place to which we will probably never return. Actually, do I have any doors of tomorrow? I don't. If I had a door of tomorrow, I could 
uh, immediately leave. That's okay. Hey. Hey. Oh, I probably have to go in. There we go. Are there any more random encounters here? Oh, yep, I guess so. I wonder if there are any more Seru, though. Ah, uh, it doesn't look like it. I was hoping there'd be more Seru in this area. Because then I could get both Vera and Theater uh, absorbed by Noah. Noah is the fastest character in the game. So she usually gets priority even over the enemies. So she kind of becomes the healer. Even though I usually end up using her for everything. I just want to get back to town. Gotta get some equipment for Noah. Not that I can afford it very well. Go ahead and do a quick heal just because. And the cool thing about the magic is the more you use it, uh, the stronger it gets. It's not tied to your actual character's level. Though I think it does still benefit from, uh, from your stats. Let's see. Alright, back to Drake Castle. Vaughn, voices. I hear a whole lot of voices from inside. Is it safe? Will we be okay? <laughs> don't worry. Just be careful. Alright, I won't worry since you're here, Vaughn. Travelers, have you driven away the mist? Yep, we sure did. So what we heard was true. Heard from who? From the wolf? Did the wolf tell you this? One look at the shining Seru on your arms and I understand how this miracle occurred. I am Drake the Third, king of this castle. You have my deepest gratitude. Um, can I ask you something? Here we go. Noah is always a hoot. What is it, young lady? There's some weird hair growing under your nose. What? Oh. <laughs> the one knight walks away to laugh. <laughs> young lady, this is called a mustache. Whiskers! Whiskers! How weird! Oh, actually, I'm quite fond of my mustache. <laughs> So be it. Now I wish to hear more about what happened. You young travelers, come over here. Yeah, Noah being raised by wolves, she doesn't know about really anything. Hmm, what an amazing story. So Vaughn was heading to Byron Monastery in search of May's mother. In order to open the water gate, must have caused you great hardship. Oh, my order to open the water gate. I am sorry for that, but here, take this. It is the water key. Vaughn now has the water key. Great. Vaughn, Noah, wait. I have a favor to ask you. I know that you both are on separate quests, but I ask you to remember the horrible mist that covers the earth, and that those like you, chosen by Raseru, have a holy mission. I have not the authority to command you. This is your kingdom, of course you do. You have saved Rim Elm and Drake Castle from the mist, but the suffering will not truly end until the whole world is free from the mist. Mr. Drake, what does suffer mean? Are you talking about dinner? No, no. That's supper. Suffer means to be very sad. Suffering is when sad things happen. No. I don't want any more sad things to happen. I hate suffering. 
bond, that means we have to destroy the mist. That will stop the suffering. Yes, I agree with Noah. Haha. <laughs> I will de I will detain you no further. Please continue on your journey. I will pray hard for your safe trip. Good luck. Oh, we have to explore a little bit first. We got a save point here, which of course we have to use. I think this guy's gonna let us rest. Yes, sir. Alright, what does Miss Nunn have to say? Yes, we did come from Ramelm. I went there once when I was young. It's such a beautiful village. Well, thank you. Got some children here. What's in here? Now all those areas... Oh, right, right, right. All those areas that were once blocked off by the gates, uh, where everybody was being held up, are now open. So there are treasure chests here we can now open. Uh, let's see what the kids have to say. Vaughn, Noah, go downstairs and go outside the castle. There are a lot of stores there now. I don't want to talk to you again. Talk to the other kid. We've been surrounded by mist for ten years. I'm glad I didn't grow up without even knowing it. Yeah, lucky you, kid. Enjoy it. How do I get out of here? I'm trapped! Yes, it does come from a mist generator. We already talked about that. What does the little lady have to say? When King Drake first told us of his plan to submit to this area, to be honest, I was very afraid. But now I'm glad that I trusted in King Drake. Oh, I got it. Okay, here we go. We put on Seru, got in the dungeon, then the mist came. That's all I remember. I remember almost nothing about that period. It was like a long nightmare. When I was a Seru monster, it was almost like being dead. But you liberated us from death. You gave us a fresh start on life. You're welcome. I don't think there's anything else in the cabinets. Do you know about the warrior monks of Byron? Yes, I do. I'm impressed. So young, yet so knowledgeable. There is actually a reason why I'm talking to all of these people. On occasion, you'll run into someone who knows uh, an art, and they'll teach it to you. I'm a court professor. I am like a scientist with a castle. It is my job to advise King Drake. I was the one who devised the plan to wear Seru and surrender to the mist. Vaughn, the creatures that attack Grim Elm said his name was Zeto. Hmm. That name sounds familiar, but I can't remember where I heard it. We did determine that the Genesis tree at Mount Rikuoa has the power to drive back the mist. Unfortunately, however, there is no guarantee that the power will last forever. The only real solution is to destroy the, the source, the mist generator, in the northeast. Oh, they even know where it is. So much for a rumor. There are indeed many legends of the Genesis trees. That they are not of the human world, that they will flower when the world is in danger. Come to think of it, I have also heard that the Genesis trees are also cradles of Holy Seru. We already know that. We've met them. I have two of them. Did I go over here already? I did not. Um, Vaughn, can I ask you something? Did you read this diary while I was in the mist? Uh, I actually don't remember, so I'm gonna hit no. Oh good. I would be too embarrassed to live if anyone read it, what was in there. I actually don't remember if I read it. 
so I'm probably lying. Do the Rasseru really have the power to awaken Genesis trees? Apparently. Well then, you might like to know that Drake Kingdom has four Genesis trees, they say. One in Renelm, another at Mount Rikuroa, and two others in the forest north of Byron Monastery. Treasure chest! A healing leaf. One less that we have to buy. Here we go. Another healing leaf. Anything else? No? Alright, what's the cook have to say? There's nothing wrong with a man who enjoys his food, but they are eating just too much. I'm starving, famished. I'm gonna make up for those years I didn't eat anything. What about this guy? Well, to be human means to be hungry, right? Yeah, I'll pretty much just fill our text. What about this guy? Before the mist came, there was a Byron monk in the castle who taught us many arts. Here we go. After the mist came, perhaps he was killed by the Seru. He left us a keepsake, a book called The Secrets of Byron. Do you wish to read it? Yes, please. It's a very long book. Which chapter do you wish to read? A robust boy. The techniques herein bestow the mighty powers of heaven and earth. The secret of this technique is... Vaughn, you already know Charging Scorch. Oh, come on, really? Alright, let's try the next one. Swan Driver. Very cool. Um, and we can't learn the other one yet. But nice to know that we found who we were looking for. Like I said, a lot of times you'll find these NPCs who will teach you abilities. Treasure. Healing Bloom, another really good find. By the king's orders, I threw all the Seru in the castle into the river. No, I want to talk to the guy, not the treasure chest. Now that the mist is gone, I suppose it's safer for us to use Seru again. But still, after being possessed by them for over ten years, I just can't bring myself to wear one. I can't blame you. Another treasure chest. Swift water. Before the mist came here, I heard a troubling rumor. That the mist comes from divisive- We already know this! Yeah, we got rid of that cage. I always wanted to know who this is supposed to be. It is never explained. I don't know if maybe it's some hidden dialogue you come back and, and reveal by talking to the king or something. But there's no way that's the king. I'm sorry. Maybe late wife or mother or something? I don't know. How long were we asleep? I can't tell if it was a long time or a brief time. You guys got the water key from the king, right? Then use it to close the water gate outside. Do you know Lizum, the one who went to tell Rimelm about the mist? Yes. What? He's still alive? So he's at Hunter's Spring. Thank goodness. I was so worried about him. To the east beyond the river, by the castle, is Byron Monastery. Many warrior monks are there. Yes, I know. Vaughn! So many, so many people! Vaughn, look! Look at all the people! They all look so happy! Now I feel kind of happy too. I want to talk to them. I want to talk about the happy people. Vaughn, do you think they'll want to talk to me? Sure, they'll be happy too. Yeah, you're right, I know they would. I'll see you later, I'm going. Very excitable. Now, I'm not using a guide for this. That's kind of the whole uh, point of, the, of these videos. If I remember correctly, if you actually follow the right steps, you can get a pretty good item for free out of this. 
I'm probably not going to get it all right, though. Vaughn, look at this. This is so cool. Young lady, that's a fighting robe. It doesn't just look good, it'll protect those pretty arms of yours. Wow, that's great. Fighting robe, how cool. What a charming young lady. I'll give you a good price. Okay. She just grabs it and runs. Hey, hey, wait a minute. You gotta pay for that. Money, you know, money. Money, what's that? What's money? Tell me what money is. It's what you need to buy things. Oh. I don't really get it. I guess I'm just kind of a goofy kid. <laughs> okay, here, you can have this back. You don't want it? Nope, I still want to know about money, so I don't want it. Oh. I want to go over there. Let's talk to those people. Now, I think after going around, she asks Vaughn like a pop quiz or something. Are you planning to go to Byron Monastery now? Well, very soon. Byron Monastery might be enveloped in the mist. Ra Seru might not be enough. Before you go, buy weapons, armor to protect yourself, and things to heal your bodies. Yes. We may have to do a little bit of grinding, but he's absolutely right. To resume business upon recovering from Nightmares of the Mist, that family sure is tough. Anyone know where my wallet went? <laughs> yeah, I think I kind of picked it up earlier. The stores reopened, but all they have are weapons, armor, things for fighting and killing. I want fresh meat and vegetables. Humph. Be careful, the world is full of weird Seru monsters. Yes, yes, I know. You can use the water key. Yes, I know. You should be able to stay in the back room of the castle for free. But if you want to spend your money, I won't stop you. Hooray! Daddy, we have a customer. Alright, let's see what Noah has to say. Yeah, uh-huh. Vaughn, I'm almost done talking. Hold on. Uh-huh. Thank you, Mr. Supply Dealer. I won't forget. Okay, now I'm going to give you a test about supplies. Which item restores the HP the most when you use it? Oh, we actually haven't learned this yet. Um, I'm pretty sure it's a healing flower. No? Wow. What does the Door of Light do? Da, da, da. Escape from a dungeon. That's right. Wow, Vaughn, you know everything. I got one wrong, though, which means I'm not going to get the best prize. Again, that's another one we don't know yet. I just know the other characters, so... Where the hell were you hiding those? We could have used those earlier, you know. Oh, I want to go over there. Let's talk to those people. I'm kind of bummed out. I forget what you get if you get them all right. Hey, Vaughn, they said it's called an inn. What's an inn for? A place for sleeping. That's boring. Thanks, Vaughn. I had fun talking to everybody. I'm done. Let's go someplace you want to go. Well, I want to go shopping. The first thing we should do is probably equipment. Now, I want to say you can get a fighting robe for free somewhere. But I can't remember where. have to buy it. I can't walk away without giving Noah some equipment. And there goes all my precious hard-earned money. See what I mean when I said in like, I think it was the second episode, 
where the money in this game is very poorly balanced. I was not joking. Is that really all I had? Go into equipment, take a look. I guess the rest is all still equipped. Yeah, that's all I have. And sadly, I don't have enough money for any um, healing items. Fortunately, we got some from Noah, but... Oh, the target and defender chains. The defender chains especially are really good to have. Ugh, that's 4,800 gold that I need. So much. Alright, well I think that's going to do it for this episode. Um, I'll stop it here. Next time we're going to head back to Rim Elm for a little bonus scene. Uh, that's actually pretty easy to miss. We'll stop off at the water spring. And maybe a little bit of grinding, but obviously that won't be shown. I really want to get those those chains. Uh, we'll stop off at the equipment shop back in Rim Elm and just see what uh, what we can come up with before we head over to Byron Monastery. But that's not far off. We'll probably make it there. We'll probably make it there by the end of the next episode. Until then, catch you later. Bye.